Welcome back, poker friends. I've got another poker game for you. It's called Ice Pick Willie. It's a fun poker game to play. Uh, dealers got to pay a little bit more attention while dealing this game. Uh, you get a lot of guys uh, interacting at the table. It's a fun game to play. So sit back and watch, and I'll show you how to play and deal Ice Pick Willie. So here's how you play and deal Ice Pick Willie. Start with a shuffle deck of cards. Determine your ante. I'm going to say each one of these chips is worth a quarter, and the ante is going to be a quarter. Once the ante is good, you give all your players two down cards, and they can pick them up and look at them if they choose. And then continuing clockwise around the table, you're going to start giving out up cards, but you only give one at a time. Don't deal everyone an up card. This player here has an option. He can either keep this card or he can pass it to the next player. And being that it's an ace, he's probably going to keep it. So you work your way around the table. Give this player here a card. And he has the option. Does he want to keep that or pass it? I'm going to say he's going to pass that card. So that gets passed over to the next player. Now he's stuck with it. You can only pass a card once. So he's stuck with the six, and now it's dealer's turn for an up card. Dealer's got a queen, and he's going to keep that for sure. And now this player here needs an up card. He's already passed, so whatever he gets, he's stuck with. And it's nice to be stuck with a king, but that's what he gets. Now that everybody has one up card, betting action goes to the ace. That's the highest hand on the table. Of course, he'll bet a quarter on that, and everybody's going to call. And now the second up card, I go to the next player that I started with. So I started with him, I'm going to start with this player next, so on and so forth. So he gets his next up card, and he can hold it or pass it. Once again, I'm going to say he's going to hold that. Going around the table, you get this guy here, his second up card. He's got a queen six. Now, he's not going to want to pass this queen because I'm holding a queen. So even though this doesn't do much for his hand, he's going to hold it because he doesn't want to make my hand any stronger. So now if dealer takes an up card, it's a deuce. Doesn't really help me much, so I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to pass this on. This player here is stuck with it, and I get the next top card. Now that everybody has their two up cards, take a look, see who has the highest hand. Big ace over here is still tall. Of course, he'll bet a quarter, and the rest of the table is just going to call. So now the next up card, I start with this player over here. He's got an eight, and I'm pretty sure he's gonna hold on to that. Working my way around the table. Dealer's got a five, and that doesn't do much for me. So I think I'm gonna pass this. And now working my way around the table still. This player here gets a seven, and I don't think that helps him any. So he's going to pass it. Now he passes around the table to the first one that needs a card. So that's me. So now I'm stuck with the seven. He gets the next top card. Now everybody's got their three up cards. Take a look. See who has the highest hand. Looks like this ace is still tall. So he feels confident. He's going to bet a quarter. The rest of the table is going to call. So now the fourth up card is going to come to me first, which is a three. And that doesn't help me any, but if you look at this player here, he's got ace deuce of clubs and he's got a five. So even though this doesn't help me, I really don't want to pass this because that could put him into a straight. So I'm going to hold that card. I'll work my array around the table. And he got a three anyway. So I assume he's probably going to hold on to that. 
Now going around the table, this player here, he's got a deuce, and we'll say he's going to pass it. Doesn't look like it's going to help this player, doesn't really help him, but he's going to pass it over here, he's stuck with it, and now he gets top card off the deck. Now everyone's got their fourth and final up card. And I don't see any pairs yet. So this player here still got the ace. Of course he's going to bet a quarter. And everybody's going to call. So now everybody's going to get their last down card. And you can take a look around the table, see what uh, people are looking like when they look at their cards, see if you can get a read on them. And the last betting round is going to be that big ace. So of course he's going to bet a quarter, and everybody's going to call. So now the dealer can say one, two, three, flip. Take a look and see what everybody has. This player here, of course he's got the straight. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, this player here, eight, nine, ten, jack. No straight over here. And this player here, he's got a pair of eights. And dealer's got a pair of queens. So that player there wins the entire pot. And got a pretty fairly sizable pot out of this game. And that ends Ice Pick Willie. So deal it out at home a couple times because it gets a little confusing. Take it to your next poker game and see how your other poker friends enjoy the playing the game. And thank you guys for watching.